Let's open the drawer and see what's inside. Oh, here it is. Oh boy, this is so exciting, and don't forget, I'm really gonna need your help today, finding all three clues to figure out what makes Biscuit happy. To play Biscuit's clues, we have to find three. Paw prints. Three paw prints. One, two, three, and those are our clues. Our clues. Our clues. And then we put them in our notebook. Because they're Biscuit's clues. Biscuit's clues. You know what to do. Sit down in our thinking chair and think, think, think. Cause when we use our minds, take a step at a time, we can do anything. Bark, bark. That we wanna do. Are you ready? It's time to play Biscuit's Clues to figure out what makes Biscuit so happy. Will you help? You will? Great. Come on. We are looking for Biscuit's Clues. I wonder where they are. A clue? You see our first clue? Where? We found our first clue, and it's on this, this pathway. You know what we need, our handy dandy. Notebook! Notebook, right. Let's make an arch here, and a line that swirls a little like this and some squiggles like this. There, a pathway. So, what could make Biscuit happy, with a pathway? Oh, good thinking. But I think we need to find two more clues, then we'll know for sure. Abracadabra, Alakazam. That sounds like my friend Alyssa. Come on, 